Welcome to today's episode of Tech Unplugged. I'm your host, and today we're diving into an exciting topic that's transforming how we interact with our computers. DeskFlow, an open source tool for sharing your keyboard and mouse across multiple devices. If you've ever wanted to seamlessly switch between devices during work or play, this is the podcast for you. Let's kick things off with a simple question. Have you ever found yourself juggling between a laptop and a desktop, wanting to share the same keyboard and mouse without all those annoying cables and setup processes? Yeah, me too. That struggle is exactly what DeskFlow seeks to eliminate. So, what is DeskFlow? It's a free and open source application that allows you to control multiple computers using the keyboard and mouse from just one machine. Imagine effortlessly gliding your cursor from your laptop screen to your desktop monitor like it's one continuous workspace. Pretty neat, right? Now here's a fun fact. DeskFlow is the current upstream project for Synergy, which means it's like the foundation upon which Synergy builds its commercial product. DeskFlow is driven by the community and is motivated by collaboration rather than profits. How refreshing is that in the tech world? You may be wondering, how can I get involved with this project? Well, the community is open and welcoming. You can contribute in several ways, from building the latest version to submitting bug fixes or suggesting improvements. It's like being part of a digital family. Let's not forget about the technical side. DeskFlow supports Wayland, which is the modern display server protocol for Linux, with experimental support in its recent version. This means that if you're using a cutting-edge Linux setup, you can benefit from this too. But let's dig a little deeper. What does it mean to have privacy by default? DeskFlow emphasizes privacy, which is increasingly important in today's digital age. For example, did you know the update check feature is off by default? Unlike other apps, they aren't tracking your every move, which is a big plus if you value your privacy. And there's clipboard sharing. This feature is essential if you're moving files and text between devices and is a cornerstone of what DeskFlow has to offer. Picture this. You copy a paragraph on your laptop, walk over to your desktop, and paste it. Just like that. Now, you might be curious if DeskFlow is compatible with other open source projects like Landmouse or InputLeap. The good news is yes, discussions are happening within those communities to enhance interoperability. This collaborative spirit is what makes the open source community so vibrant and fascinating. Before we wrap up, let's briefly touch on the history of DeskFlow. It originated from Synergy, vast created back in 2001 by Chris Shoneman. Fast forward to today, and we see it evolving into a platform driven by community needs rather than corporate agendas. As we get closer to the end of today's episode, let's remember the cool things we've talked about, how DeskFlow empowers users to control multiple machines effortlessly, its commitment to privacy, and the collaborative efforts within the open source community. So here's a question for you to ponder. How would your work or gaming experience improve if you had the power to control all your devices with just one keyboard and mouse? I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. Thank you for joining me on this tech journey today. If you found this episode insightful, share it with a friend, and don't forget to tune in next time for more explorations in the world of tech. Until then, keep innovating and collaborating.